Okay, here is uh, another physics problem involving trig. And this will be your, maybe your first look at the idea of a force body diagram. This will count as a very informal introduction to a force body diagram. So here we have a mass suspended from a ceiling by one string with a tension T1 at an angle X from the horizontal. And then we have this horizontal string also attaching it to the wall next to it. In terms of sine, cosine, X, tension one and tension two, draw a force body diagram of horizontal and vertical forces acting on this hanging mass. So what's common to do in this situation is to draw just a single dot in the middle here. And these horizontal and vertical arrows going out in each direction and labeling, labeling them appropriately. So let's go. Here is the first picture. So this horizontal force we know um, to the left must be this tension two. There's no other force pulling to the left in this picture. If you think there's another force pulling to the left, you have to tell me what it is. There is only one force pulling in the downward direction. That is the force of gravity, which is also known as the weight of the mass. What's left? What's left is this upward direction and this rightward direction. So to see, uh, to see how to label these correctly, we can take this arrow and move it temporarily over here to the other side of this tension, this T1. And this angle in here is X. So we can come up with components here for this vertical and horizontal components for this tension T1. Let me just fix that. Oh, okay, well, there's X right in there. All right, now blowing it up a little bit. I broke it down to the vertical is sine, which goes with the opposite side times T1 and cosine, which goes to the adjacent side. So now I can get rid of this T1 and X right here for my final answer of all of the, oops, all of the angles, all of the horizontal and vertical components here. So our final answer would look like this. So this sums up this picture right here. It sums up, um, it sums this way right here to break everything into horizontal and, co and vertical components. All right.